Good morning, today I'll be doing a quick tutorial of how to back up your Grand Theft Auto 5 game using Rage Plugin Hook. Um, this it's good to do um, if you like to play mods with mods and if you use um, Script Hook V by Alex Blade, he does a great job keeping that file updated. But unfortunately, he needs to update that file every time Rockstar does an update on the game. And it does take a couple of days because I'm assuming you know that that is a lot of work. He does a great job doing that, and it does take a, a couple of game. But backing up your file game, you can you are able to continue playing the Grand Theft Auto using your mods until um, the mods developer upgrades their file in order for you to update your game. Um, so a quick way to do this is well, right now I have the file actually right here, the game backup. Uh, right here is a copy that I did, but I'm gonna run it from scratch. So right now this is the, my folder where I keep my Rage plugin uh, 0.52, which is the latest. What I wanna do is I'm just gonna highlight all of these for the exception of these three folders. I'm gonna copy. I am going back to my Grand Theft Auto 5 game, which is here, and I'm gonna overwrite the files that I already have in, so I'm gonna just replace all that, right? So right now what's gonna happen is, because I replaced that, um, Vage plugin is just gonna go through the initial startup setting. And let's just wait until it starts. So of course you gotta accept the agreement. It's gonna check for all the requirements which I do have all the requirements. The good thing about this, if you are missing some requirements, let you know. So this is the backup game version. Um, it gives you this, it's actually asking you if you want to back up your file. So I will just hit enter. And it's right now, it's actually backing up the file into my Grand Theft Auto directory. Just wait until that finishes. Okay, and then it, it takes you to here. Um, I changed the setting here. This is usually F, uh, F4, but I actually like to change it because some of my mods, I actually use F4 for something else, um, which is for my trainer, actually. For my trainer mod, I use F4, so I changed that to N, which is a key that I don't use at all um, i'm not going to launch it right now because i do want to show something else so well i'm going to save it let's close that should we start and i'm just going to close it here um so for you so you guys can see it actually created the file for me and it's right here as you can see it's the same file that i have you know, I keep this here because if for some reason something happens, you know, it's good to have. Um, or if someone needs that file, if they didn't back up, um, if they didn't back up the game and they need that file, just hit me up on my YouTube channel. Yeah, it's going to come out with this because it's trying to load it. Just hit me up on my YouTube channel, send me a message, and I'll definitely um, make the initiative to send you guys this, this backup file that I created over here. Um, this is pretty much it, you know, my game is backed up, so whenever Rockstar um, decides to do an update, all I have to do is just go back to my Rage plugin and reverse the, the update, which I'll do another video um, soon, once Rockstar creates an update, I'll be doing a video, a tutorial of how to reverse the update using Rage plugin. Um, that's about it, if you do did like this video please hit a like um subscribe for future um tutorials that i'll be doing thanks